In this video tutorial, I will explain how to draw the isometric projection of a circle using four center method. So here assume that given diameter of the circle is 60. The first step is you have to find the isometric length of 60. So for that I am drawing the isometric scale here. Along the 45 degree line, I am taking the true length. Then automatically if you draw a projector along the 30 degree line, you will get the isometric length as shown here. Now this is the isometric length. Here reference axis are drawn here. This is the horizontal line. With respect to horizontal, if you draw a 30 degree line as shown here, this is the x axis. This vertical line represents the z axis. This 30 degree line represents the y axis. Now I am going to draw the isometric projection in the x and the z plane. So now take that isometric length along x axis and the z axis parallel. This is parallel to z axis. BC is parallel to z axis. CD is parallel to x axis. AD is again along the z axis. Now parallelogram is completed. The midpoint of CD is E. The midpoint of AB is F. Next step is identify the longer diagonal. Here longer diagonal is AC. Draw a line like this. Identifying the longer diagonal. This is the longer diagonal. Now draw a line joining this corner and this midpoint F. This corner B and this midpoint E. Automatically you will get the intersection points here and here. These intersection points are two centers. This is center 1. This is center 2. Now take center as C1, radius as C1F, C1F draw an arc. This is the first, first arc using the center 1. Next, take the center as D, this point, radius equal to DF, this radius, draw this arc. Next, take center as C2, radius as C2E. Center as C2, radius is C2E. Draw this particular portion of the arc. Next center is B, radius is BE and draw this particular portion of the arc. This is the 4 center method to get the isometric projection of a 